welcome in Munich at the Intersolar here at the booth of Kostel. Next to me is Andreas Schmalenberg, product manager. Andreas, what is new about the PlentyCore Plus, PlentyCore BIG2 and Pico IQ G2? In fact, the G2 stands for means generation 2. We will spend a um, new improved hardware, especially improved interfaces with this G2. And for example, we will add uh, four digital outputs. At the moment, we have only one. So we will add four digital outputs. We will add a second Ethernet port. And for us, really important will be the Wi Fi functionality, um, which allows us as well to use a web based and easy web based initial. Uh, commissioning assistant. So let's talk about the Wi-Fi. What is the advantage of this function? Yeah, the advantage is that uh, first of all it's a, it's a must. Yeah, every device is equipped with the Wi-Fi. So it was missing in our Plenty Core inverters. Now we decided to integrate it. X works. So the advantage is um, you don't have to attach or to install any additional antennas or some some Wi-Fi dongles, uh, which are known in, in our business as well. So it's integrated X works and um, yeah, it's a must because you can easily now connect your inverter, your PV plant to your local uh, Wi-Fi, your local house's Wi-Fi um, and you can save some yeah, installation costs. You don't need to um, use a cable, a Ethernet cable between your router and your inverter, for example, and you have the possibility then to, to have a bridge between long distances this Wi-Fi bridge, I mean. At the beginning, you mentioned the web-based initial setup. Um, what does this mean for setting up the inverter? During um, um, the inverter starts for the first time, it is, it is opening a hotspot. And you can connect to this Wi-Fi hotspot with your mobile device, your tablet, your smartphone, for example. And uh, once you have connected to our hotspot, automatically we are launching the web server, the web menu of the uh, inverter, and then the first commissioning assistant is uh, loading. We have uh, more options to be configured, more parameters, or possibilities, um, if you use the web-based version. Of course, you are able to use the display initial commissioning assistant like you are used from the past. This is still poss possible with our inverters. Yeah, but the web-based version has many functions in addition. There are a lot of advantages. What is the advantage of the four digital switching outputs? Yeah, we, are, we have still equipped our inverters with one switching output to switch yeah, external loads like um, yeah, heating, for example, um, to use your PV energy surplus. So, and now we have the possibility to, to switch four outputs so you can add, you can connect more loads, more external loads with this um, yeah, four digital outputs like uh, heat pumps for example. They have two special input signals which are fully compatible uh, with our inverter now. Um, they are sending for example required commands um, for your heat pump and we will have an improved menu where you can directly select the mode what you want. So you want to switch on the heat pump, then you have a pre-configured menu which helps the installers yeah, to, to set up all the complete system. And this is one new uh, function with the four digital outputs as well. And the last question regarding the uses for storage systems. Will the second generation of Plenty Core Plus and Plenty Core BI remain compatible with the current systems? Of course, the G2 will be compatible with the existing uh, supported battery systems. During this year, we will add the LG Resoflex storage and the Pylon Tech Force H1, Force H2, and they will be compatible with our inverter as well, even for the generation one, of course. But the generation two is just a step in between. Small step for us. The biggest step for us will be then next year we will come out with the generation three. And this will offer then uh, the long awaited backup mode again. I'm curious about that. Thank you so much for your information. And if this information is helpful for you, please let us know. Give us a thumb up, share this video or subscribe to the YouTube channel.